I've been with this beautiful lady for 13 years and I think we have a happy house. Noelia, what do you think? Give me three words that describe a happy house. Our happy house. A happy house, it would be communication, dedication, and a lot of patience. <clears throat> For me, it's more like one of the two, in this case, it probably is gonna be her. It's crazy. <laughs> then you have to be goal driven while one person has to be like the goal driven you know we're going to achieve this as a couple or as a family and communication communication is winning angel okay. what it takes to have a happy house make it nice diego yes what it takes to have a happy house laughter As you can see, everybody has a different idea on what a happy house is or what it should be. Regardless, two things for sure. Number one, it's good to have a happy house. And number two, happy house is good for business. You're happy, you're productive, your wife, your kids are happy, they are not on top of you and distracting you because they want to do X, Y, Z. I have a, a home office and I, I'm very productive and I think it's part because well one I have productivity habit but two I have a happy house it's a beautiful day it's an amazing day I crushed my goals if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please subscribe like I mentioned in yesterday's video it's going to be here so you can watch it yeah here click most of my viewers are not subscribed to the YouTube channel. Don't know why, I can't understand it. I'm trying to fix it. I, I need to figure out why. A comment down below will be awesome. Again, if also if you want me if you want to ask me a question, leave me a comment down below. Ask me via Twitter, Angel F. Anderson. Angel F. Anderson. And if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. It means more than you think. And like always, create the life that you want to live. Don't leave the life that is handed to you. Manage your time wisely and grow every single day. Peace.